Uh, and Stormcast is kind of saying that, where there's enough moisture that we might see a snowflake or two overnight tonight into the day tomorrow. The better chance will be to our south. Notice the blues here trying to show up on the other side of the Kansas-Nebraska border. This is Thursday morning, 6 a.m. Mostly cloudy, maybe a flurry or two, but the better chance to the south that tries to get into our area and kind of runs into that warmer air that's in place. I think it'll be just above the freezing mark uh, as we head through the afternoon hours. So we might see a little rain trying to change into a little snow. Uh, again, this is all going to be pretty light and generally south of Interstate 80 and then it just kind of fades away. We might see a return of a little couple of raindrops as we head through the second half of the day, Thursday into Thursday evening. That won't amount to much either. So this is not a huge precipitation make maker. In fact, uh, I'm going to show you uh, what one model says for snowfall potential, and it's not a lot. We're looking at maybe a half an inch towards the McCook area, this little swath of blue, that might be an inch might be. So yeah, it's not going to be a big deal, but you may see a snowflake or two. You may see some raindrops, maybe mixing in at the same time on and off, but it will not amount to much. Tonight, temperatures are going to fall uh, almost normal. This is about where we're supposed to be, between 20 and 25 degrees, a little bit of a northeast to southeast wind. 24 degrees, mostly cloudy. We'll call that quiet and mostly cloudy. Tomorrow, cooler. We're, we were in the 50s today, so we'll be in the 30s and maybe the 40s uh, for parts of uh, eastern Nebraska, Seward, Lincoln, Beatrice, Fairbury, even Omaha, Nebraska City, and Columbus, all around 41 degrees. Cloudy uh, and that mixed precipitation possibility, uh, it won't amount to much. Northeast wind at 5 to 15 miles per hour. Seven day forecast, uh, since we're not going to get any snowfall out of this, we jump right back into the 50s. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, we might even get close to 60 and then temperatures cool off a little bit as we head through next week. 50 degrees on Tuesday and then back into the 30s we go. We're not quite done with the winter weather yet, so 30s for highs Wednesday, Thursday, Friday of next week. But until then, it is going to be very, very mild. Just a small chance for some mixed precipitation tomorrow and then dry and very mild as we head into the weekend. Well, I'm sure folks who were traveling here for state basketball, girls' state basketball, were thankful that at least maybe the storm waited till tomorrow so they could all get into town. Absolutely. All right, thank you very much, Rusty. A split day on Wall Street.